Hi, I'm Dr. Grover. I'm here to demonstrate a photo facial for you today. I uh, wanted to first show you the machine I utilize. I use the Palomar Starlux, which is the most powerful machine, uh, most advanced technology for the light source. It is emitted from a sapphire tip, um, from what we call the Lux G head. The tip is cooled with water, providing uh, comfort for the patient, and then it also has mirrors that recycle the photon energy. Uh, back and forth from the treatment area. Um, intense pulse light is similar to a laser but has a broader wavelength. By utilizing a broader wavelength we're able to break up pigment in the skin, we're able to treat the small vessels well and improve skin texture. It's also less damaging to the skin and patients can return to work the same day and not have to worry about a long downtime for two weeks as you might have with a, a laser peel. The wavelength is um, for example, 400 to 800 nanometers, whereas with a, a laser you'd be looking at a monochromatic or a single wavelength um, and much more an intense type of light. With this machine we can hook up laser heads, um, but for our purposes today we're going to be using the intense pulse light with the broad wavelength. So I've adjusted the machine settings to her particular skin type so we'll get the appropriate wavelength for the treatment of pigmentation. Pigmentation is what we want to treat on Kristen's face today. She has a little bit of uh, sunspots or solar keratoses and we're hoping to lighten those up. She's had one treatment which gave her great results. We're now going to go for her second treatment. We'll typically take about three treatments to get real effective clearance of these sunspots. Any discomfort with that? Doing fine. You see we're getting a little bit of redness, which is normal. And oftentimes the redness after treatment will persist for about 24 hours. Sometimes we'll have a little bit of peeling from this. And in rare cases we'll have some blistering, particularly over the pigmented areas. See how we've created just a, a little bit of redness around the, the forehead and areas that we've treated there. It's fairly minimal. Um, we've darkened up some of the skin pigmentation from the solar keratoses and that's a good sign. That means that we're doing our, our treatment well and over the next week we'll see the skin pigments lighten quite a bit as the uh, skin goes through its natural recycling and we'll do another treatment in about three weeks. At that time, we will have done three treatments and we should have most of these sunspots cleared up and a much improved complexion. Thanks for watching the video and if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to call us here at the center, 303-320-1530.